And what other Pokemon game lets you freaking start off with a level 50 Salamence? Yes, our first Pokemon is Salamence with freaking Earthquake, Dragon Dance, Brick Break, and Dragon Claw. Okay, Brick Break is not really the best move to put on Salamence, but still, this is a freaking Salamence. It has an excellent ability of Intimidate. It is one of the all-around most powerful Pokemon around. This thing is such a powerhouse, for a time it was tournament banned. Yeah, I don't think I need to say enough good about this thing. The fact that we are starting off with Salamence, I think, speaks total volumes. Even though Metagross is good as our opponent, that thing might as well just give us the game right here and now, because that thing does not stand a chance. We have Earthquake, it is done. And because it is the law for all NPCs in the land of Ori to have really stupid names, let's see what your name is. Lostin. Lostin? More like losing, am I right? And my pun was so bad it made him question his life and drop down to his knees. Standard fare. Well, this area, it seems we're in a Pokemon lab of sorts. Yeah, that's probably the only simulator you're going to be seeing between the main game and this one. Why, hello, Michael. Okay, let's see. I'm writing up a summary based on the base on the basics of Pokemon battles. Like I said, it's mostly basic invention, but if you care to look, I've written my summary on the whiteboard. After all, the basics are important for a reason. Indeed, the basics are important. And there's probably a whole three of you watching this video who don't know how to play Pokemon games, but... I do need to cater to those people as well, it's only fair, but at the same time, those of you that have played Pokemon games before, you're probably going to find this really boring and redundant, so I'm going to go through this as fast as humanly possible, and you guys know me, I am excellent at talking fast and paraphrasing stuff. So let's do this one item at a time. Beat up animals! Yes, when they're owned by other people. Don't suck! Read the four options. Water puts out fire. When things get rough, get the hell out of dodge. Your opponents will infuriate you by doing this. We'll get to this later. When to get stronger, when to get money. I explained this two sentences ago. When to hit harder, when to get bigger, you better have burn heal. Water puts out fire. Water, once again, puts out fire. And it does double damage when it does. Fire is put out by water, and it does half damage when it does. All participants in battle get stronger. You use two Pokemon 99% in this game, so the first half of this is completely pointless. It's against the rules to catch something when it passes out, but not if it's weakened. There we go. Now all of you know how to play Pokemon and- I wish everyone wouldn't drown them with such gushing praise all the time. My son and daughter will be spoiled rotten. Oh, my mom's name is Lily and my name is Michael. I get it. I'm the main character because I come from the one family that has normal names in a sea of dumb names in this region. Wow, a cargo ship carrying Pokemon disappeared without a trace. Is that really possible? I'm finding that a little hard to swallow. And he just walks off and things fade to black, because that's the last we'll ever hear of that. This Psyduck here is like dancing. Cider! Cider! <laughs> I'm sorry, but for how derpy Psyduck is, I think Cider is like the perfect name for him. Sound from the TV is said to appear to be sound from the TV set appears to be disturbing the Pokemon. Really, I thought it was the sound from these big old honking speakers, not the TV set itself. Oh well. What do you have to say? This is actually uh, something that I like. This is actually a character that I like though because he foreshadows something really interesting. Rumor has it there is a new Pokemon even Professor Crane has never seen aboard that missing ship. It's very worrying. I hope the Pokemon aboard are safe from harm. And it looks excellent. I do have to say. Anyway, we have a world selection screen, no roots in this game, unfortunately, just like Coliseum. And I gotta say, this is where Kaminko's house is. I want you to pay, take special note of where it's located. Our baby sister crossed plains that wide, got across a river, and then walked between two mountain ranges to get to this house. I think our sister is fully well defending herself. Let's see what this VCR has got to show. Let's see, what kind of inventions do we have here? We have the power draining light bulb. It's an, it looks like an ordinary light bulb, but it positively gulps electricity at 10 times the usual rate. Using this electricity bills will grow shockingly, and it won't be easy to find out why. Chobin thinks this is dazzling. Okay, Chobin, what else do you got? The time cut recorder. It works with your video deck. When you're recording a TV program, this device ends the recording five minutes early. If you recorded a movie, you'll be at the best part when suddenly the screen goes blank. Chobin